structure of the antibody so the antibody so it is the y shaped structure so it has two light chains and two heavy chains so these light chain and heavy chains are linked by the disulfide bands so here the antibody contains two ends they are fab end fab end and fc end so the antigen always binds at the fab end so here this fab end uh, the antibody always recognizes the antigen in this place so hence it is called it is the place of uh, it is called as paratof okay right uh, next uh, fc end so it is always uh, connect with the immune system of the another cell or another antibody okay right next uh, antigens antigens right antigens right it is the substances substances which induces the detectable detectable power or detectable capacity of the any pathogen or you know any pathogen or parasite is called as antigen okay it is the detectable capacity of the any parasite or any uh, pathogen so right it is uh, recognized by the t h cells and b cells t cells and b cells t cells and b cells examples of the antigens are polysaccharides nucleic acids nucleic acids and proteins nucleo proteins nucleo proteins okay so here the antigen binding of the binding of the para top of para top of antibody is called as epitope epi top okay so it is about the immune system in the one of the basic concepts of antigen and antibody